Our U.S. federal prosecutors have filed a revised indictment against former President Donald Trump that accuses him of trying to overturn his 2020 election defeat to the incumbent U.S. President Joe Biden. Right, this comes after Supreme Court ruling said that former U.S. presidents have broader immunity against criminal prosecution. The revised indictment filed by Special Counsel Jack Smith includes the same four charges leveled against Donald Trump last year but is centered more on his role as a candidate seeking re-election rather as the president. This report brings you all the details. Take a look. Former President Donald Trump was hit with a new 36-page indictment on Tuesday related to his effort to overturn his 2020 election defeat. The new indictment was obtained by U.S. Special Counsel Jack Smith's team after narrowing their approach to the election subversion case following a U.S. Supreme Court ruling that former presidents have broad immunity from criminal prosecution. The revised indictment lays out the same four charges it brought against Trump last year, but it focuses on his role as a political candidate seeking re-election, rather than as the president at the time. The new reworked indictment no longer includes allegations that Trump sought to pressure the U.S. Justice Department in his bid to overturn the election. Dropping those allegations appeared to be an effort to keep the prosecution alive, after the Supreme Court found on July 1st that Trump could not be prosecuted for that conduct. A Justice Department spokesman said the case was presented to a new grand jury, which had not heard evidence from the original case. Attorneys for Trump did not immediately respond to a request for comment. Meanwhile, Republican vice presidential nominee J.D. Vance slammed special counsel Jack Smith, calling the fresh indictment charges an effort to influence the election. I think it's clearly an effort to try to do more election interference from Jack Smith. He should be ashamed of himself, and it's one of the reasons why we have to win, because he should not be anywhere near power. And for more on this, a correspondent, Susan Tehrani, has sent us this report on the same. Let's listen to this. Special Counsel Jack Smith has filed a new indictment against former President Donald Trump despite the fact that the Supreme Court ruled granting former presidents immunity. The new indictment charges the former president with the same four federal offenses related to the overturning of the 2020 election, but it has adjustments to conform to the Supreme Court ruling and is now focused on actions outside of presidential duties. For example, pressuring state officials with false election claims. Now, allegations involving the Justice Department and co-conspirator Jeffrey Clark have been dropped. The case will proceed to court on September 5th to determine what the next steps should be. Susan Tarwani reporting from New York for We On World is One.